Do I even remember how to vlog? I don't think so. It's been so long. This lighting is so bad. Oh my gosh, what do I do? Let's see if this is better. Yes, a little bit. So basically, I unintentionally took like three weeks off of YouTube and I don't even know why. I don't know where I've been. I I don't know. We will discuss this later in the vlog when we like chit chat or something because I just got to my cousin's house, but we need to talk about that. But I don't even know how I'm going to explain it because I don't know why I did it. So there's that. But I'm back. It is Valentine's Day weekend. It is Thursday the 11th. So it's still a few days till Valentine's Day, but we're, we're starting early. I don't have a man's. No, 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 no boyfriend here, but I am gonna hang out with my girls tonight We're gonna have a girls night and we have a few other plans this weekend. So it shall be a fun weekend I just got to my cousin's house now. It is very dark outside. That's why the lighting like I'm trying to hover above this light right here But it's still shit. So I say we just go in and have ourselves a girls night They better do heart-shaped pizzas or else they're breaking all my dreams Ooh. And thank you for calling Papa Don for this delivery or carry out. Delivery um, are you guys doing those heart-shaped pizzas? We are. You are? Okay, can we get one of those, please? Oh, it's the freaking... Beautiful. Wow. Wine night just leveled up. Straws for our wine. Wine bottle, not wine cup. Who needs a cup when you have the entire bottle? Exactly. It's just a waste. I mean, exactly. We're gonna drink the bottle anyway. Exactly. We each have our own it. bottle. No need to dirty anything. <laughs> also, we discovered I did I say this to the vlog? But we discovered our favorite wine. Well, we're new to wine. So barefoot, strawberries, it's like five dollars and it's so wine. good. You know, cheap like wine. The ones that you Get when you're growing up because when you're you have when you're young and you're yeah. learning how to taste wine and like wine So good strawberry and I just don't like red wine yet. I'm growing maybe one day, but not yet Okay, I'm gonna finish my glass. why do you always make that face? <laughs> do you like it? Yeah, I just got a comfortable <laughs> We got the wine, we got the puppies, we got the girlies. Girly pop number two, and John Tucker must die. Oh, why am I number two? Well, you were just the second person I went to. Haha, ha, bitch. Why you so much is so bad? So doing it, you don't. Ready? Scissor! Wine is gone. Everyone's wine. All three bottles, gone. Okay, fast forward a few days. It is now Sunday. Happy Valentine's Day. I love and appreciate you guys so, so much. I hope none of you guys take this day as like a sad day if you're single or if you're alone. Like, just make the best out of it. And again, it's a day to show love. I love you guys. It is like 8 o'clock in the morning, not even. I woke up super early before my mom would get up today because I wanted to run to the store and I got her some flowers. So got my grandmother some flowers. And I also got me flowers. You know, don't forget to show the people around you how much you love them, but also don't forget love yourself, too So I bought myself flowers. I've actually never done that before. I've always wanted to but this reminds me of like dance recital when I was like five years old bringing back some good mems But like I realized I love receiving flowers my aunt and uncle they're like florists So they made me some for my birthday and I like loved it. I was obsessed. I felt like Oh, so special. I also got to my mom her go-to Dunkin order because she's still sleeping So I thought I would just surprise her with breakfast and flowers I also bought her this frother she's been wanting so that's at home waiting for her She's gonna be very surprised and I just got myself some coffee guys. I promise you I have not been buying coffee I've realized what a waste of money it is So I've been like watching like myself what I buy and I haven't bought coffee in like three weeks So I treated myself to a small 
Not a medium, a small. But I did wake up early and I have a long day ahead of me. I'm hanging out with Emily today. We're getting brunch. That's why I didn't get breakfast. It is the ugliest day out today. Like, this is the same as yesterday. The sun just didn't want to say hello. Okay, I'm going to run home, give this to my mom, my grandma, and then start getting ready. We're going to have a glow up today. I feel like I haven't gotten ready in a minute. Okay, makeup is done now to find an outfit. Mm, my favorite part. And this is the outfit. I've been learning lately that you can have the most simplest outfit ever, but if you have jewelry to dress it up, you can go from like a two to like a nine. It's insane. I'm literally just wearing this most basic like pink flowy top. I probably wear this almost every Valentine's Day, honestly. And then some just black ripped jeans. But then these earrings, oh my God. You guys know I'm obsessed with like my gold hoops, but these earrings are like three gold hoops into one. Can you see that? I'm obsessed. Hannah Maloche has like an online jewelry store. I think it's called Starlight village if i'm correct but she was selling ones that look just like this but they were sold out so i was really sad but i found these at target the exact same ones target guys i'm obsessed with them they just they're amazing they're my favorite earrings times three and then my flowers beautiful love the vibes happy valentine's day my little pink mic I still have to do my hair, so I thought I would bring you guys along for that. I got dressed first because I want to kind of slick back my hair, so I wanted to put my shirt on before I did my hair so I don't mess it up. Recently for slick back looks, I found this brush at the dollar store, guys. I don't know what kind of brush this is, but it looks like this. It literally says sleek on it, so it like pulls back my hair so perfectly. It looks so straight, so classy way better than brushes like this like if you want to slick back your hair a brush like this i'll try to find one on like amazon and try to link it down below for you guys or just like look at your dollar general anyways i'm gonna try one of those slick back like braid looks where you slick it back completely and then you put in a braid i don't know i'll show you my hair is greasy i'm gonna wet my hair first there we go i thought i would kind of take this time to like chat with you guys because again i took a break from youtube without meaning to and i i feel like we need a life update i'm gonna look horrible during this life update but just know it'll come together at the end so like I said in the beginning of this vlog I accidentally took like I don't even know how long it's been like three weeks off of YouTube I don't know what happened the rest of my life has been like fine I'm not unmotivated at the gym school's doing good work's doing so good it's just YouTube and that's so unlike me because like YouTube is my girl like YouTube is my shit I love YouTube but I've just been so what's the word uninspired that's it I think with this past year with COVID like we're literally going on a year with COVID that's insane to me it's really hard to make content when you're just in the house all the time David Dobrik hasn't posted in a year what the heck everyone's kind of just feeling uninspired I feel like and YouTube has been very dead lately so I think that's really it I've just been uninspired like not knowing what to post YouTube has been boring to me even though like I love making videos I just haven't had any ideas but again I always say January and February are the most boring months of the entire year so that could also be why I'm so uninspired because there's really nothing going on right now like this might be the most fun thing I've done all year this weekend I've just been watching Netflix the whole beginning of the year so I'm gonna get back on my shit life is finally starting to pick up I have plans I have things coming up in the next couple weeks so that should be the end of my break again I'm so sorry but I just haven't known what to post there's no excuses for it like I suck basically I hope that whole thing kind of made some sort of sense but just know, YouTube content is coming, baby. So far, we have the hair and a ponytail, and now we're gonna braid it. But on other news, I have been so obsessed with Netflix. Like, since YouTube has been so boring, Netflix has been my baby. I've watched All American. I've watched High School Musical, the series. I've watched... What else? Stranger Things. Oh my god, I know I'm so late to Stranger Things and All-American, but I am obsessed. I've just been on like a TV show tangent. I've been trying to stay off of social media a lot less and just like read or watch a show, just not be on my phone as much. Oh, Emily's texting me. She's about to be here. Oh god. But yeah, just comment down below some of your favorite shows because I've truly been obsessed and I thought I would share. But that is my life update. I'm gonna finish my hair because Emily's on her way and then I'll update you guys when I'm done. Okay, I'm here with my boyfriend for today funny funny start can I say this Emily actually has a boyfriend this year <laughs> but I'm lucky because he lives across the country 
like literally cross country. So I, I get her for Valentine's Day again. <laughs> okay, I really thought Valentine's Day was mainly like, I thought all the couples go to dinner, but we've been sitting in my car for like 35 minutes waiting for our reservation and it still hasn't rung, so we're just gonna go in. Turns out as we were walking up, um, they called our name or they texted me, so it's okay. Emily's currently shitting her pants. <laughs> she just drank out of this water and she drank on this side and right here is another lipstick mark. So, Okay, breakfast was amazing. Emily's still a little scared that she could possibly have COVID, but like the chances of COVID actually being on that cup is like slim. I pray to God that it wasn't, but like that was scary. There was literally a full on lipstick stain on the cup. It's fun. We're gonna forget about it. We're gonna have a great day. What are you looking for? I don't know if there's gum in there. Oh, is there? Yeah. Oh. Um, we're gonna jam to some um, Galentine's music. I don't know. And we're gonna go to the mall now. <laughs> I just wanna shop till I drop. Bop, bop, bop. Okay. Why does the camera like look uneven? Why is no one letting me out? Does no one watch your spot? I know. I was like, oh, here we go. Like, we're good singers. Honestly, we are. I used to watch it so bad. Comes back around. Let's go. I don't know what we're going to buy, but I want, we deserve to treat ourselves. Treat yourself. Also, I got Skims masks and literally, when you put them on, you can barely breathe. So that's kind of a good sign, I guess, because they're very thick, but it's hard to breathe. Here we go. <laughs> I've recently found a new love for Nordstrom Rack. Never knew her before, but I'm obsessed. I have just around the mall. It's yeah. It really is either hit or miss, but like today it's looking like a miss. But like, look, Nike's for like $65. Personally, not a fan, but Fila Slides, $15. What the heck? I can't find anything I'm in love with. I'm trying to be careful what I spend my money on, but like these are so cute, but I don't need them. They're $30, not bad, but I'm just trying to learn how to spend my money wisely. It's really hard. Next is Ulta, but at least here we have gift cards, so we're good. Every time I come to Ulta, I always have to come to Ordinary because I feel like I'm always running out. I need the caffeine solution. Okay, just kidding. Looks like I'm just getting caffeine solution because I can't find the other thing I needed. I literally just told you guys how much I love Stranger Things, so I wanted to support Queen because I'm actually obsessed with her and she's like 16. So I didn't really need anything here. I just wanted something, so this is the cheapest thing. Okay, shopping today. I well, I completely just hit the mic. Shopping today, I would say 50-50. We got some things we needed, but a lot of things we wanted were not there. Yeah. We needed underwear, check. We needed clothes for a trip, we'll see. Oh, we both wanted this perfume, none of us got it. And uh, the most depressing part about today is we were about to go to our favorite cookie place, but for some reason, they're closed. I'm not a happy camper. Yeah, I could cry. Me too. Well. Off we go, home. I'm also like extremely thirsty because like I haven't had water today because they fucked me up. <laughs> okay, can we just get two original glaze, please? Two original glaze? Yes, and then two water cups, please. Okay, we're fine. It's donut time. It's donut, donut time. Emily has not drinking water since the restaurant because she's too afraid now she's gonna I get COVID. I took one sip. She was scared after that. She barely touched her coffee. Thank you so much. Oh, okay, thank you. Okay, now I need hand sanitizer. I feel like after touching money, I feel so disgusting. Ew, 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 ew. I don't know how we're gonna go to normal life after COVID. Feet bop. <gasps> Something flew out. Flew out? It was like a twig, like, was just thrown at me. That was scary. It better, like, the hype, like, everyone hypes it up so much, I just don't know. <gasps> they are warm. Mm. Oh my God. Wait. The hype might be real. Wait, what the hell? That just like, it tastes like heaven. And I usually don't get glazed donuts at all. Oh my God. Happy Valentine's Day to me. Huh? Okay, I have a question. This is probably literally just a me problem, but I'll be driving all the time on like road trips or like even like eating a donut and I forget that I have to drive. 
Like I think I have a Tesla a lot of the time. But again, that's just probably me. I don't know. It's I'm weird. It's terrifying when we're going to Jacksonville and you do that. I do it on like every road trip. Okay, bye. Wait, just kidding. Before I say bye, I have a theory and I want to talk about it. Today is Sunday, February 14th, and I'm proving my point right here before we'll see what happens. So basically right now, James Charles is posting everywhere that he went bald. He's been bald for a few days now, but do I believe it? No. Do you believe it? No, because he, cause he wouldn't shave his hair off, but then again, like, it looks real. Yeah, at the same time, I'm like, keep examining each picture, like, would he though? Maybe he had a cry, like a mental crisis. <laughs> I have three points to make on why I think it's fake. Number one, he said he shaved it himself. No way, it's too perfect, like it literally looks perfect. There's no like shadow, nothing. Number two, what was my number two? Um, yeah, but you've never shaved your head before, like, could but it like, be that easy to shave? Like, no, but I'm talking like, you look at bald guys and it's never like that perfect. Like, there is not one, like, like it's literally all the same color, like, perfect. Number two, no influencer, creator, whatever, YouTuber would just go out in public and get paparazzi before they either Instagram post about it or make a YouTube video about it. So, that's how I think it's fake. He would not let paparazzi get him first. That's all I gotta say. That's all I gotta say. What was I just remembered my other point and then it left my mind. Wait, wait, James Charles. Oh, and I think he's been posting for a few days because I think he had someone do his hair and then he took an entire day or two and make a, made a million content, stories, everything to post for like a week and he's just gonna post a video saying, I pranked the world, boom. Emily laughs at me because I've been like, she's been going off about this. <laughs> yeah, I've been, um. I've been on a tangent about it just because I'm so like positive, but I guess we will see. I just wanted to vlog it before a video comes out proving that I'm right. Okay, now bye. We're wrong. Okay, I just got home and it is literally so nasty out. I turned like every single light on in my room because it was just so dark and so overcast and I don't like those vibes. But as soon as I got home, I got back in my sweatpants that I was wearing this morning. I kept the top because I'm making some TikToks, but I wanted to get out of my jeans immediately. When I got home, my mom usually every single year, like my Valentine's Day gift, she gives me like a little something and she always says it's from my dog, Piper. So Piper gets me a little Valentine's Day present. Like she literally got me this card and said, you're the bestest mama in the whole world, like pretending it's from my dog and it's so cute. Is this from you? Did you get me a present? Excuse the laundry, um, I need to put that away, but they're clean. And then she got me a new book since I have been reading a lot lately and that is unlike me and I'm gonna keep it going. Anyways, I thought I would sit down really fast and show you guys what I got at the mall today. I don't know, do you guys like hauls? I personally love watching hauls. Like they're some of my favorite videos to watch. So let me know if you guys like my hauls because I realize I do a lot of them. I have a shopping problem, but I'm, I'm trying to get better. I told you guys. I'll show you Ulta first because it's just on top. I had a gift card, keep that in mind. I didn't get that much at all. I went in there needing this. I ran out of my caffeine solution. I use this every single morning. I also needed vitamin C, but they didn't have that. So I'll get that next time I go. And then I don't know if you guys have seen these girls on like Pinterest and Instagram are doing the most beautiful eyeliner looks with like color. And I was trying to do with eyeshadow, but it is just not the same. It does not come out vibrant. It's not cute. It kind of looks chalky. So I saw these and I was like, oh my God, I need to cop them. So they're called NYX Vivid Brights Colored Liquid Eyeliner. Got in the color Vivid Petal and Vivid Violet. So I thought those would be some really fun colors to play with. And then I told you guys I am obsessed with Stranger Things. I know I'm very late to the game, like a whole five years late, but it's fine. Millie is literally the cutest thing ever. So I wanted to support her and get Florence. I have so many masks, so much skincare, so I feel like I did not need any more of that right now. Like I have too many masks to even use by myself, but I still wanted to support her somehow. So I saw this Looks Alive eye balm and it looks just very different. I always have like a pot of like moisturizer for under my eyes or like some kind of cream, but this is cool. It comes in this little tube and it has like this metal cool applicators. So I thought this would be really nice for like waking me up in the morning. It's vegan, cruelty free. I just wanted to support her because I literally am obsessed with her now. And that is all from Ulta, not that much. Then I just went to Pink. I don't go there often, but I needed underwear, honestly. So it was like seven for 32. I thought that was a pretty good deal. So we got a ton of underwear in here. All my underwear, I just don't like buying underwear for myself. Like who wants to buy themselves underwear? That's just like one of the most annoying things to buy. Like why do we have to pay for that? And why are they like not that cheap? 
And then I went to Forever 21. I've honestly been liking them a lot more lately. Like there was a phase there that I didn't think any of their clothes were cute at all, but they've been stepping up their game the last like year or so. I need to try all this on because all the dressing rooms are closed. First, we got this bathing suit. Emily got the same one in like a different um, style, but we got new bathing suits. It's just like this pink leopard cheetah vibe. I don't know. I thought it was cute. I just have to try this on because I don't know about my boobs. That's always my issue, is the boobs. Do they fit? Do they not? I don't know. And I feel like Forever 21 really runs on small boobs, which I, I don't have. So it's a struggle, it really is. Then they had this little crop top, tank top, like workout top, I feel. And it has like a really nice, thick, built-in bra. So I was like, <laughs> I need that for my boobs. I just got it in black because I always need a good black to go with all my leggings. I have a bunch of colorful leggings and never know what top to wear with it, so. I got this. Then this cute little crop top. I was mainly looking for summer clothes because I was going through my closet and I have no summer clothes. Like literally maybe like three or four tops. So I got this little crop top thing. I don't know. I just thought the flowy at the bottom was really cute. And then I got like, I don't know. What, what is this material? It's almost like silk. I don't know. I thought it'd be a cute little going out top. And then lastly, I thought this would just be like the easiest top ever. I want to go to work and want to just throw something on with jeans. Boom. It's just a little peplum top and it's very flowy. I thought this would be good fit. Very easy, like everyday top. And you know what I realized? They're all around the same color. All right, well, I am becoming that girl, the pink girl. Okay, I'm gonna go actually try those on right now because I just want to know if they'll work with the tatas and uh, that is the plan for now. I'm gonna make some TikToks, try that on, and I'll see you guys when I make dinner. I'm making dinner tonight and chocolate covered strawberries for my mom and my grandma, and we're gonna have a little gals night, so it'll be fun. Okay, famous TikTok pasta. Oh, it's hot. Oh, it's fogging. Okay. Okay. Oh, no, it's hot. Ooh. Okay. I'm a little bit late on to trying this, but we're going to try it out for Valentine's Day. Ready? Oh. I feel like it's supposed to be softer than that. We'll try this, like, hardened spoon. Maybe this is better. It's a little bit better. Ooh, exploding. I just washed this. I just washed this. And it just exploded all over me. Why? Just my luck. Okay, I suck. We already ate. It was so good. This was a TikTok recipe. It literally went viral. And it was so, so easy. I just added pasta and spinach. And it was amazing. Highly recommend. Super easy. But now we're watching Enola Holmes. Because Millie Bobby Brown is in it. And I just watched Stranger Things. And I saw she was in this too. So now we're watching that. It's pretty good so far. I hope you all have an amazing week. And I hope you had a great Valentine's Day. And I will see you in my next video. Bye, guys.